here we are in November, December, pre-Invisalign, and then next time you see me, it's bam, the Invisalign is in. Hello, YouTube. Um, today is the first day that I'm pulling this camera out to vlog something. I don't know what the deal's gonna be, like if there's gonna, if this is gonna come after the intro video or if the this is gonna come before the intro video but yeah anyway so i haven't filmed anything because i've been waiting for my backdrop to get here which is actually wallpaper the space we're working with for like formal sit down videos is kind of limited so i wanted to get something different um, and something kind of simple um, i don't have a lot of space to do like a super in-depth um, background with like things in the background that are like blurred out and look really nice so I decided to get wallpaper, and anyway, that came yesterday. Um, we have started to decorate for Christmas, as you can see, because we um, are going out of town for two weeks here um, this weekend, which is the end of November, to visit family So for Thanksgiving. So we wanted that when we come back, um, all the Christmas decorations are up, so like the Christmas spirit is here to greet us because we absolutely love Christmas. Anyway, so... I mainly wanted to get on here because I went to my dentist today and we talked about um, Invisalign and doing an Invisalign consultation. Getting my teeth, you know, aligned and straightened is something that I've always wanted since far back as I can remember. Um, my parents, you know, they weren't financially in a place where they could afford that, which is okay. I don't hold that against them. But now that, you know, I am in a place where I can make it work and, you know, thanks to the job I have right now, I can afford to do something like that. Um, I decided that it was finally time. Um, and we're not, we not doing braces over here. <laughs> Too old for that. But um, anyway, so I just wanted to get on here and kind of open up the vlog situation about um, Invisalign by saying that I went to the consultation today and they showed me like a before and after of like, you know, like a projection of what my smile is gonna look like when it's done. And it's actually super exciting. I, I didn't do anything. Um, before you can really start it, before you can, they can send off the scan of your teeth to make the trays, like you kind of have to sign something. And so I just decided to go home and like give it some thought just to be sure, because you know, it is a, it is a pretty big deal and Invisalign is definitely expensive. So I didn't want to just go in like blind without really giving it some thought. And um, yeah, I decided that I'm going to do it. Um, I'm probably going to stop by tomorrow to sign the paperwork and to make my first payment. And then my aligners are supposed to come in like two to three weeks or something. So it's, it's pretty quick, um, but it's going to be amazing. And I can't wait. And I'm excited for you, uh, for you guys to, you know, be part of this journey with me, however many of you there are, and there are a whole lot right now, but that's fine. Obviously it's to be expected, but um, it's gonna be great. So yeah, for a while I was debating between Invisalign and like Smile Draft Club, and that's also one of the things I wanted to like look up coming home today instead of making the decision right away in the office because Smile Direct Club is definitely more cost effective, but there's just certain things that like you get with you know doing Invisalign. And ultimately, I think those plus, you know, the reviews and some articles I read were what swayed my decision to do Invisalign instead. But yeah, I'll try to, you know, keep everything updated so that everyone can kind of see how it goes as it goes. But yeah, that's the main, main thing I wanted to discuss today. Tomorrow's going to be a super early night and busy day with prepping for our, um, our trip to Florida. Yeah, getting stuff packed, getting the car ready to go, all that mess. But yeah, that's it. Hello, YouTube family. Um, family? I don't know. I am running super late right now, but I wanted to jump on here right, um, just to give you guys an update about the whole Invisalign journey. Last time you guys saw me was before the holidays. Wait, it was too loud. Last time you saw me was before the holidays and um, I had gone and done like my consultation um, and I paid the deposit and I ordered my trays and it was going to take two to three weeks to get here. So now we are post-holiday season and I'm on my way to my appointment. 
um, to go ahead and get all the stuff put on your teeth to like make them stay in place and to actually like get the Invisalign put on and to talk about like care and all that mess. Um, so I'm actually on the way to the appointment now. I'm running super late, but I wanted to give an update so that um, it's not just like, oh, here we are in November, December, pre-Invisalign, and then next time you see me, it's bam, the Invisalign is in. So yeah, so that's the update I wanted to give. Um, I will check back in with you later. Okay, so I'm leaving the appointment now. First impression is they're pretty tight while not feeling like painful. They just like really, really fit my teeth really well. I do have like a little bit of a lisp that you might be able to hear or just, you know, something. It just sounds kind of funny. I knew about having to have the attachments put on my teeth so that the trays would stay in place but I wasn't really sure where they would go. They don't really tell you ahead of time where they're gonna go. They just kind of like put them on you and then you see it. But mine, I have a couple, like there's some teeth that only have one attachment and there's some that have two. Unfortunately for me, I have my front tooth right here has two attachments, like it these little bumps. Uh, so that's kind of trash, honestly. Um, but you know what, it is what it is. Um, yeah. Week one week one um i don't know if ultimately like the attachments are going to go somewhere else because you get different trays after a while and um you have to come in after a couple of months for like a progress report and a rescan so maybe when they rescan things might look different and so the attaches might go somewhere else but I feel like probably not. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be stuck with bumps on my teeth in the exact same place that they're at now until I'm done with um, the whole Invisalign process. So I'm just gonna have bumpy front teeth for like the next year. So um, yeah. Uh, oh, and they had to like shave down a little bit between some of like my molars just because they had to like make room for all the movement and stuff because my teeth are pretty close together. So that's the update right now i guess there'll just be updates here and there as we go throughout videos um but this is pretty much like the intro to invisalign and the whole process um so yeah now just gotta edit it and you know keep track of everything and try not to snack <laughs> because you're only supposed to take your invisalign out like one or two hours of the whole day like you sleep with them you wear them all day all night except for when you're like eating or brushing or whatever so i don't know it's gonna be a hard life for me with snacking so we'll see hopefully this video helps anyone who's like thinking about getting it done or has questions and isn't really sure like where to look or you know might not even be sure what questions to ask in the first place so yeah that's it for right now um i'm gonna head home Hey y'all, so doing like a quick later on in the day check-in. Um, same day, obviously, from when I got my Invisalign put in. And I just wanted to get on here and talk about how the experience has been just for like day one. Because I feel like day one would be the day that takes the most, the most getting used to. Um, so it's been fine. The retainers are snug. They're not tight, they're snug. So they're not uncomfortable. It's just, you know, a feeling that you have to get used to just having them in and just... Um, a little bit of a lisp or you know different way of talking for a little bit come on sugar uh, eating so far has been the most difficult part just because the attachments have made it kind of difficult to eat I'm not sure if that's something that's going to get better with time or not but for right now like it just I can feel them against like my cheeks and stuff and like they're not super smooth they're actually kind of like rough in comparison to like your own teeth or the aligners so they're like rubbing up against my teeth and like it's not the most comfortable feeling and because i'm so aware with of them or just they're a little in the way for the time being it just feels like um, i've been biting my cheek <laughs> so that kind of sucks but other than that it's been pretty seamless i would say so yeah i just wanted to pop in and do a quick check-in on how day one has been so far. And if earlier today me talking about the attachments on my front teeth made it seem like I regret the decision of getting the Invisalign in, um, I don't. 
my camera's so low. I don't. I just wanted to say that real quick because I was watching the playback and it sounded, I sounded like I was having some second thoughts, which I'm not. Come on, sugar. But yeah, that's it. That's all I wanted to say. That's it for today's check-in. Um, see you guys later.